So how y'all doing today? I hope y'all having a blessed day. So I'm making a little brunch here. And what I got going in this pan is a little olive oil, some uh, fresh sausage links, onions, and some jalapenos. And I'm going to make me a scramble. Uh, I'm going to be using some smoked gouda. I love smoked gouda. And finishing up my salsa with this. That's a great brand of salsa if you ain't ever tried it. Very close to fresh. And if I have me some flour tortillas, yeah, this be breakfast tacos for sure. Uh, my friend George called me today from up north. Uh, he's in a convalescent home. He's been sick. He's feeling better. He had some kind of intestinal infection. And really, it rubbed me the wrong way that uh, the nursing home didn't figure that out before it got so far to where he had to be in the hospital. But he said, you know, uh, a lot of it today is about the paycheck. And I said, I still don't understand that. Because I worked in nursing. And yeah, we we needed our paycheck and appreciated it. But uh, it was about people. All right. It really was. And so uh, I asked him, are they treating you well? And he said, yeah, they treat me pretty good. So I was happy to hear that. And uh, we confirmed his address because I'm sending him out a care package for Christmas. And I told him, now let me know if you find anything in there you like. Are you sure they won't confiscate it? <laughs> and he said, no, they won't. So it was nice talking to my friend George. Now, I don't have a whole lot of friends, but it's not because I'm not friendly. I just keep my circle tight. And when I do connect with somebody and make a friendship with them but they're important to me and uh if i'm not important to them uh they're not my friend for long so <laughs> it's got to be mutual i guess i'm just old-fashioned that way and i've been knowing george over 30 some years so but my friends are important to me they really are and if i can be there for them in any capacity uh and I, I'm going to, and, and a friend will reciprocate that. And George has. He's been there for me uh, when I when I needed help. He's been there for me. So it was so nice talking to him, and he wished me a Merry Christmas. And I said, well, Merry Christmas to you too, dear. And, uh, yeah. So I'm, I'm finishing up my scramble here, and I'm going to have that with the rest of that salsa over there. I hope you all are having a blessed day. Stay safe, stay healthy. Uh, thanks for stopping in, for your thumbs up, for your comments, large or small. I appreciate them all. Yeah, y'all have a blessed day. Bye-bye.